At least seven people have died in flash floods triggered by heavy rains in central Vietnam. According to officials, thousands of houses have been submerged. More floods and landslides are expected. Residents are being urged to leave their homes. Fraudsters have taken money from French President Nicolas Sarkozy's personal account. Sarkozy complained to police in September after small amounts were stolen. Criminal and financial fraud squads are investigating the case. The UAE has reasserted its commitment to the principles of non-proliferation and nuclear disarmament, as well as complete transparency and total cooperation with the International Atomic Energy Agency. So. Tanker drivers claim they're pushed into dumping untreated sewage in storm drains due to the stress of queuing up to 12 hours a day. These actions have been blamed for uh, wide-scale pollution on, off the Sea of Jumeirah in Dubai. Dubai municipality says it's currently undertaking a new project to ease the congestion at the al plant. Police have arrested two alleged members of an international gang of jewel thieves, dubbed the Pink Panthers, suspected of heists worth over $134.7 million, including a diamond robbery at a jeweler's in Wafi City. A new radar has been installed on Sheikh Zayed Road, able to detect vehicles wanted for outstanding violations. According to Dubai police, it can also detect speed, direction, and whether a car has been stolen. Okay, that's the news. Okay, that's the okay. news. Now it's the sport. <coughs> You're right on time, yeah? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, first motor racing, and Lewis Hamilton has won the Chinese Grand Prix, moving closer to the world title. While well, the McLaren driver dominated the race, while his title rival Felipe Massa took second place, Hamilton takes a seven-point lead over Massa, heading into the season finale in Brazil on November the 2nd. Tennis and British number one Andy Murray will bid to win his second Masters Series title today when he takes on uh, Francis Gilles Simone in Madrid at 6 p.m. our time. Murray came back from a set down to beat world number two Roger Federer at 3 6 7 5 7 6 8 6. Finally, football in the Premiership. Hull City take on West Ham United tonight at 6 o'clock our time. That's followed by Stoke City versus Tottenham Hotspur at 7. That's it for News and Sports.